So how do you become the world's largest maker of gummies from a simple packet of pistachio nuts? The Albanese family here in Indiana can answer that question. I am here today with Dominic, Tess and Bethany Albanese in their candy wonderland. And I want to learn a little bit about the journey you've taken to create this wonderful place. Tell me about that. Well, our father and mother, Debbie and Scott Albanese, were the ones who started the business uh, with the help of my grandparents. And so it really came about where my mom and grandma were out shopping one day and they had bought a pound of pistachios and they realized the price of pistachios. And somehow they knew what the actual market was on pistachios at that time. So they brought them home and talked to Scott and our grandfather Richard and said, I think we have a business here. They decided they would open just a candy shop we weren't making candy at that time, but we were just buying and reselling candy, and then it went on from there. Scott, um, he was in his 40s, and he said, I got one shot left at doing something and creating something. And so he said, you know what, I see the most um, complacency in the market in the gummy industry. Everything was really hard and rubbery, no flavor. You couldn't tell the green one, different from the red one, different from the orange one. It all just had a fruity essence. And so he said, there's got to be a way to improve this. I want every single flavor, every single color to have a distinct flavor. So that's why when you try our Albanese gummy bears, the orange one tastes like orange, the red one tastes like cherry, the green one tastes like apple. So every color we have has a distinct flavor. My sisters and I here are actually a test group. This is, we're actually like food <laughs> yeah, yeah. tasters. So that's not like in our, yeah, that's not in our official job descriptions, but it's certainly what we did for years as children. So growing up, we went through all these flavors and just to perfect them until we had the perfect mix. And it was like, okay, which ones go together really well and would blend really well in a, in a 12 flavor mix. And so that's really where it was born. It took years of, of studying and learning and testing and trying to figure it out. So Dominic, I understand that you're an inventor in your own right. Tell us about some of the things that you're doing here at Albanese. If I had to sum up Albanese in one sentence, we're a research and development company that happens to have operations. All we do all day long is research and new, um, new products, new confectionery, new chocolate, um, and then also dietary supplements. One of the newest ventures that we're working on is putting um, RX prescriptions into gummies. It's a very new um, process, and um, we're just in the benchtop stages at this point, um, but it's gonna be really exciting once it hits the market. So, I know your candy store is an attraction in itself. Could you tell us a little bit more about your retail operations? We have two retail stores, one in Maryville, Indiana, one in Hobart, Indiana, and we have a, attached to the store in Hobart, Indiana, we have a 350,000 square foot manufacturing facility. We have just under 500 employees and we're looking in 2018 to add between 50 and 80. And in our Hobart store, we're actually the largest candy retailer in the United States by volume sold. And we know that because we sell to all of the other candy stores in the United States. So it's really amazing to see the amount of volume. Just this year alone, we're gonna see over 2 million people come through our store. Um, and I think they really enjoy it because they get a glimpse into our factory. We have some windows they can look through. Uh, we have some, a tour showing them how we make our candy. So I think they enjoy really getting involved in seeing how the process of, you know, gummies are made. How can I be sure that the gummy that I get has Northwest Indiana quality? Great question. So we put this A on the tummy of the gummy. So wherever you're at, you look for that A on the belly and then you know it's certified Albany's. I want to congratulate your family for the incredible business that they've created here in Northwest Indiana. Please visit our website at saverindiana.com where you'll find a link to all things Albany's. For Savior Indiana, I'm Jonathan Day.